Today we will solve this equation. Always I give the hint at the beginning of this slide, okay? So we need to convert this equation to the quadratic equation. So let's pass and try actually how do you convert this equation to quadratic equation. Let's move to the solution. So this is the given equation. So uh, whatever I'm proposing the solution, right? So that solution is possible only when you have two common factors, like see, two common things. For example, see x, x power 4 coefficient is 12 here and the constant is 12 here, okay? And the x cube coefficient is minus 56 and x coefficient is 56, okay? When you have the, these two are the common, then only this kind of solution is possible, okay? So divide entire equation with x square term, okay? So what do you get here? So x square minus so if we simplify this, it it will be twelve x square minus fifty six x. You know, right? X to the power of four by x to the two x square x square in cancel, and it became x square. Okay. Similarly, x cube by x two is x plus. Here we will become like you know, constant like 89 minus 56 into 1 by x plus 12 by x square equal to 0, right? So now take the common between these two right here, right? Take the common 12, okay? It will become like x square plus 1 by x square, okay? And take common from these two is 56, okay? It will become like minus 56 x plus 1 by x, right? Then, plus 89, right? Equal to 0. The last equation I read it in another term here, okay? Now, what you do, right? Let's take the x plus 1 by x is equal to another variable like y, okay? So, let's do the whole square, okay, well, x plus 1 by x, do x plus 1 by x whole square, okay, so what it is, it became like x square, a square plus b square plus 2ab kind of, right, so it became like x square, 1 by x square is called 1 by x whole square plus 2 into x into 1 by x, right, so if you simplify this, you'll get it as like x square plus 1 by x square plus 2, right? So, x, x get cancelled. If you further simplify it, so x plus 1 by x we have taken as a y, right? So, it became like a y square equal to x square plus 1 by x square plus 2, okay? If I simplify it, it is x square plus 1 by x square subtract both sides with 2, okay? So, the 2, 2 get cancelled. Here, we have the y square minus 2. Right? So, if you substitute into the above equation here, it is 12 into, it is y square minus 2 minus 56 into y plus 89 equal to 0. Okay? If you simplify this equation, you will get it. Like 12 y square minus 24 minus 56 y plus 89 equal to 0, okay? Further simplify it, 12 y square minus 56 y plus 65 equal to 0, okay? Now, finally, we convert it to the quadratic equation, okay? So, this general form of the quadratic equation, right? It's like ax square plus bx plus c equal to 0, right? So, this can be solved by making the complete square, right? Complete square formula, right? That is uh, x is equal to like minus b plus r minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2a, right? So now here this a is 12 and b is minus 56 and c is 65. If you put it into here, you will get the this y values as you will get like 5 by 2 and 13 by 6, okay? So now what is y? 
why you have taken it x plus 1 by x, right? Okay, that substitute the two two values in this, right? Like x plus 1 by x equal to first is 5 by 2 and x plus 1 by x equal to 13 by 6. Okay, so if you substitute it, so if you simplify this first equation, right? Again, you can take the LCM like x here. Okay, so if you take the LCM x here, so it becomes like x square plus 1 equal to 5 by 2. And if you do cross multiplication here, 2 into x square plus 1. So, okay, multiplying here like this, right? So, equal to 5x. And if you further simplify it, you get it like 2x square minus 5x is bringing to this side. So, it becomes minus 5x and this plus 2 equal to 0. And if you simplify this equation, you will get it similar like x square plus 1 by x equal to 13 by 6. So that is gross multiplication 6x square plus 6 is equal to 13x. So that is equal to 6x square minus 13x plus 6 equal to 0. Okay. Now again we got the two quadratic equations. Okay. So if we solve this quadratic equations 2 and 1 by 2 and 3 by 2 and 2 by 3. Okay. You can verify by, you can substitute these values into the main equation and you can verify if you want. Okay. Thank you for watching. Okay. Please like and subscribe and share with your friends. Thank you.